single phase induction motor are most commonly used home application like electrical fan or pumping etc inside the induction motor a stator and a rotor present the basic principle of induction motor is electromagnetic induction when electric current flows through a conductor then magnetic field around the conductor is created similarly when current flow through the stator coil the magnetic field around the coil also created and due to this stator current another emf induced in the rotor and the rotor start rotating but in this process rotor is not self starting because starting torque is not created in the rotor if we give the starting torque then the rotor keep moving in split phase configuration single phase current passes through two winding main winding and auxiliary winding this is because to achieve high starting torque if the rotor is placed altering magnetic field of the main winding then the rotor only vibrate it does not rotate because it does not get the starting torque to give the starting torque auxiliary winding are placed then at present of auxiliary winding then the rotor faces the starting torque in 90 percent of induction motor use square phase rotor where small steel or aluminium discs are placed inside the rotor in this rotor blue arrow indicate the altering magnetic field due to the main winding and auxiliary winding and the green arrow indicate the direction of torque at the present of main winding and auxiliary winding the rotor become self starting and finally the rotor shaft connected to the mechanical drive thank you for watching subscribe us for more thank you